hello community i hope you are doing good in this discussion we will see how to apply default filters from the search view and in case you missed previous discussion about how to add dynamic filters based on the date and date time field please check link is given in the description if you want to learn more about odoo you can visit the weblands channel under the home screen odoo 1718 development tutorial right now we are working on this playlist if you are a beginner and want to learn from the beginning you can visit this playlist because this is the main playlist and those are the topic wise sub playlist available all right let's back to our main topic guys if you didn't subscribe this channel please subscribe it will help me a lot plus you will get the latest notification about the upcoming sessions so let's say here how we can apply the default filters right so for example if i will go to the students right by default it should be the school group by options available without i'm selecting this option so how i can do it right or let's say if this group by option is not you want to apply but let's say you want to apply from the filters right like this then how you can do it so first thing is we can go to the schools custom add-ons student views and student view.xml file so you can see this is our xml file right now here we don't need to touch anything in the search view but we have to check here in this windows action right in this windows action we have added only three fields name res partner and the view mode now we will add one more extra field which is context in this context we have to pass as a key dictionary format okay like this by default we have to apply one one means okay uh, that is the true right and the whatsoever the filter we will pass here it will automatically apply so that's the reason i'm using here one so here first thing is we need to use search underscore default underscore this keyword we must have to prefix always to apply the default filter okay this is the keyword we must have to use or else it won't be work so let's say we are using this one plus we can go to here in the search view from the search view we have to take the filters from the this filter tag only okay so let's say the student name so this name we have to copy from this name attribute here we can paste here so it means search default is the keyword we must have to pass and after the existing search filter we, the name specific name we have to pass here okay and that's it after we have to upgrade the module so let's say if i will try to upgrade the module guys if you don't know how to configure or doing pycharm like this way please check editor level playlist i already explained everything here let me refresh the patch now you can see right by default it's selected sunny student from this filter now here let's say you want to also apply the group by option right so it is also possible so for that we can go to again here uh, we can use the gender group by right so we will take this name after here we will use search default and then after paste this one and make it as a one right here one more time we have to upgrade the module so this is the simple filter and this is the group by filter okay and let's see once we refresh the screen now you can see it will automatically filter the sunny student and the gender and once you click here you can see by default it will display this two right if i will remove this one so by default it will take all the students and it will group by with the gender right so like this way you can set the default search by option from this windows action right you can see here if i'm going to the contacts right and if i will go to the student so you can see this default group by option is available like this way 
So if you still have any doubt related to this topic, please comment below and see you in our next session. And our next session would be how to create the form view. Alright, so see you there.